The sun is out, we enter June, rates increase yet again. Last time they went up, the market went down swiftly and a little bit sideways. This is the May Property Market Report for Earlham and Caddy said, enjoy. Thursday the 11th of May saw interest rates increase to 4.5%. When they went up previously on the 23rd of March, my video at the time reported reductions galore with an air of a caution from many buyers. Let's see how the market reacted to this latest change. Let's start with the most relevant stat, that is information about the houses being redu reduced. As I mentioned earlier, March saw a massive 44 houses being reduced in just one month. This time the market has res responded with 25 reductions. So clearly it's had an impact, but not as much as March. As a comparison to last year, when it was a seller's market, there were just nine reductions in the month of May in 2022. So there's more, but not as much as March. So a small positive. There are so many indicators available which give a picture of the market, and I feel this is the best where we are in the current trajectory of the market at the moment. Moving on to houses bought to the market, 31 in May this year, comparing this to 2022 when there were 35 houses. So pretty much similar stats there. Sales agreed, this is a real positive indicator with 31 sales being agreed last month compared to last year when May saw 35 sales in 2022. So houses are still selling, hooray. Houses that are available in May 2022, there are 106 houses you could buy this year saw 176 so far more choice for buyers out there online property views this is how many people are looking at houses for sale every day 2022 saw 107 views per day on average currently we are hovering around 39 views per day so that is less than a third down so not as many people looking at houses on the market online Another great indicator there. Tip of the month, staging your home for pictures is incredibly important to create that story and impression of your home. Bath towels laid out, a throw over your bed, candles, or even some daffodils floating around your house if you've got neutral colors. Help to bring a vibrant color to the pictures and make sure all those light bulbs are working. So interest rates up, the market still ticks over, sales agreed at a normal level, houses brought onto the market at a normal level, reductions higher than usual, property views are down considerably, considerably compared to last year, and there are more houses available. There is an easy way to describe this kind of market, that's called a balanced market, and there's absolutely nothing wrong with a balanced market. If you need any help, tips, advice, or evaluation on your home, reach out at any time. Feel free to message me direct on Facebook. If not, I'll see you again next month and let's hope the sun's still shining.